So if you've been married for more than a few years, you probably think you know your spouse really well. But have you ever put it to the test? <laughs> <laughs> well, we did just that. Reluctant or not, our husbands joined us for a round of the Not So Newlywed Game. Check it out. So it's time for the latest edition of Not So Newlyweds. And Brooke, I feel like we should have a theme song or some sort of game show we like open. Did, did that work? I like it. That's good. All right. So, Chris, now you ask the question. The ladies, what is your husband's favorite restaurant? Oh, oh, I know this because he ate there all the time. I know I'm not getting this right. One, two, three, show your paddle. In. Oh! Olive Garden. I don't know, you Olive Garden? It a lot. We're Italian. Olive Garden is not Italian food. It's like, it's the Taco Bell of Italian food. All right. So that's a no. Michael, three, two, one. Everything! <laughs> <laughs> yes! Yeah. Olive Garden in your life! Oh, you can eat breadsticks. Yeah. Hey. Olive Garden, all you can eat breadsticks. <laughs> what are you saying? Pizza is your favorite food. Okay, this is like rapid fire. It was the first time oh we came God. to lunch. Okay, let's go. Okay, so the next question for you gentlemen is a question I don't even remember the answer to. It is, who caught the bridal bouquet at our wedding? Okay, Chris Boychelli, yes. get your paddle ready. One, two, three, show your paddle. Oh, oh! Good one. Oh, that's a good one. Are you ready, Michael? I'm Here ready. Here we go. Three, two, one. <laughs> Game. Please don't catch the bouquet, love. Oh, they don't? It has to be a woman? No. Oh. Okay. All, right, All right, next so question, next ladies. Question. If your husband could have a dinner with anyone from the past or present, who would it be? Okay. Oh, this is like, there's so many. Amity, on three. One, two, three. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, All right. Brooke and Michael, you ready? Point One, three. two, three. Turn those paddles. What? <laughs> your grandfather. <laughs> I thought you like. I thought you'd want to talk to Shaq. I thought you liked Shaq. Oh man! <laughs> to you, gentlemen. If your house is on fire, what is the one thing your wife would grab, other than your children? We just had a conversation about this very thing maybe we two weeks ago. Well, that just put more pressure on. So if you guys don't get it right, <laughs> all right, Chris Boy Shelley, get your yes. paddle ready. One, two, three. All right! Oh my gosh, you guys are doing good! Three points! Uh. <laughs> and her purses. It was on I the other side. One or two, I'm not gonna lie. It was the flip side. Okay, Brooke and Michael, okay. get your paddles ready. One, two, three! Oh, uh, man. Grandfather <laughs> posters? HD? Grandfather. My grandfather was a magician, and we had these old posters from his shows during World War II, where he'd do shows for um, like war bonds and stuff. The hard drives of the family photos. No, Michael, that's not what I would get. They're on the cloud. They live on the cloud. We've already talked no, about this. <laughs> Man, we need to go to counseling. <laughs> All right, we're right. going on. Next one is, what is your husband's most repeated sentence or phrase? Better not be relaxed, because that's not going to fly. No. <laughs> I did immediately think of uh, trigger word, but. <laughs> I did too, but I, I tried to sip it back for a second. On the count of three, one, two, three. Oh, that's I a good almost one. broke that. I almost did. What is sweet chicken? It is nothing, it's weird. My executive producer, Joseph, once asked me, do you eat a lot of sweet chicken? I said, no, I don't even know what that is. It's just a phrase my husband uses. When something's going well, you go, sweet chicken. Okay, sweet chicken, man. Our turn. Oh, this okay. is a gimme, Brooke. Are you ready? Three, 
two, one. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Points to Michael for that. Oh, what's new? That's true. I love you too, though. I do. All right, gentlemen. Your right, next you question done. is, what reality TV show would your wife participate in? Okay. This one we can get. I know it. I know that like The Bachelor and Bachelorette are like your enjoyable ones, but I would hope I that don't that. watch The Bachelorette. Amity, uh, you're leading the witness. I already wrote something down. It's hard to tell. Okay, okay. Yeah. All right, ready? And three, two, one. Yes! Oh, yes. Oh, yes. What is Southern Charm? Southern Charm is like a story about like Southern people in Char Charleston and it's just really pretty. All right. I think we're going to finally get one right right now. Yeah. Okay. First point <laughs> on the floor. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Yeah. 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 Ah. Woo. Woo -hoo. That's oh, awesome. Man. I, I, have, I don't have, an, I have no words, Brooke. I, wow. I, we got one right. We got one right. We <laughs> saved our marriage, Amity. It's, it, we're going to be able to stay married after this. It's Thank good God. Stuff. Yeah. It's good stuff. Yeah. Uh, oh, my goodness. <clears throat> well, I enjoyed that so much. We can talk more about that later, torturing our poor husbands. But, um, <laughs>